What is, what is an accident? accident? The Institute of Medicine of the National Academy of Sciences defines an antioxidant as a substance in foods that significantly decreases the adverse effects of reactive species, such as reactive oxygen and nitrogen species, on normal physiologic function in humans. Let's explain. With modern technology, we can observe human function at a microscopic level. At the cellular level, we can see the innumerable number of molecules interacting in normal life processes. Molecules are comprised of atoms, which are made up of protons, neutrons, and a cloud of electrons. When a single molecule loses one of its electrons, it may become unstable. In this state, a molecule is described as a free radical. Free radicals can cause damage in the human body. They will try to replace their lost electron by stealing one from another molecule, which often causes harm to normal human function. The loss of an electron is called oxidation. Stealing an electron can cause a chain reaction of free radical production. When there are excess free radicals, there is a potential for damage. This is oxidative stress, or an excess of oxidant molecules. Damage resulting from oxidative stress is related to many negative health outcomes, including neurodegenerative diseases and accelerated aging. Sometimes, no damage occurs when an electron is stolen because both molecules are stable. Molecules that can remain stable when they lose an electron are said to have antioxidant activity. These antioxidant molecules can also be called free radical scavengers. The presence of antioxidant molecules protects against oxidative stress and therefore protects against damage and disease. There are many types of molecules that demonstrate this antioxidant activity. Some antioxidant molecules are naturally present in the human body, but there are also antioxidant substances present in foods that we eat. These comprise the antioxidants described in our earlier definition. The degree of antioxidant activity can be measured by laboratory tests such as ferric reducing antioxidant potential and oxygen radical absorbance capacity, otherwise known as FRAP and ORAC measures. A higher FRAP or ORAC value indicates greater capacity to show antioxidant activity. One study generated a total antioxidant capacity per serving for dozens of fruits and vegetables using ORAC values. This study suggested that apples, artichokes, beans, potatoes, and many types of berries have high total antioxidant capacity values. These high values indicate the presence of various chemicals that act as antioxidants. Because of the protective effects of antioxidant activity, foods that are associated with high ORAC are often marketed for their health benefits. For example, foods that show high antioxidant activity in tests may be advertised as superfoods or fruits as superfruits on packaged foods and beverages. It is important to remember that the effects studied in laboratories may not be identical to the effects of antioxidant-rich foods when metabolized in the human body. Molecules with antioxidant activity play an important role in human health by limiting damage by free radicals. Consuming foods that contain antioxidants may therefore have a beneficial effect on health so it is important to remain educated and informed when making choices to consume food and beverages.